Kevin McCarthy doesn't want facts and logic to be presented. He does not want investigations that find facts. That ruins his whole game. Oh my God. You guys. This is serious. This is serious, you guys. Oh my God. It's Jover. It's Jover. Merrick Garland named a special counsel in Hunter Biden investigation. Oh my goodness. This is terrible. I demand that we impeach Hunter Biden right now. Let's read about this. Uh, David Weiss, who's been investigating uh, criminal activity uh, against President Biden's surviving son, Hunter Biden, has been named special counsel. He's been investigating Hunter Biden for the past, like, five years or something. Attorney General Merrick Garland said Friday, Weiss made the request to be special counsel to Garland on Tuesday of this week. Yes. Uh, Weiss, a Trump appointee. We're Remember that. That's going to that's going to factor in later as U.S. attorney who was retained during the Biden administration has been investigating Hunter Biden since 2019. So about four years. Joe Biden actually did become the president. Divisive statement. I know I'm very brave to say so. Uh, then. Biden had the chance to just fire him. He could have if he were crooked if joe biden were crooked he could have said hey weiss good job you fired you done get out we don't need your services go but joe biden being not an absolute brain dead moron knew that that would look crooked if you take over and then fire all the people who are investigating you you look like a criminal so he didn't do that so Weiss, who was a Trump appointee, was retained, which means they didn't fire him. So he was retained because that would be crooked if he got fired by Joe Biden while investigating Joe Biden. They kept him around so that it would be correct. Uh, so that's important, too. I think Joe Biden did the right thing there. conduct the ongoing investigation described above as well as any matters that arose from the investigation or may arise. So they're going to determine and they're going to do an investigation. Now, who thinks that the Republicans are excited about this? Well, you're wrong. They hate it. House GOP blasts appointment of Hunter Biden special counsel. They're mad that the person they've been calling a criminal for four or five years is going to be investigated by the DOJ. They don't want that. No, sir. They do not want facts getting in the way of their angry feelings about Hunter Biden. This see, top House Republicans are accusing the Biden administration of attempting to stymie their investigation into Hunter Biden. You're going to in the, the very brain dead stupid republicans are very angry that the doj the department of justice the people who are in charge of investigating crimes are going to investigate hunter biden because it will get in in the way of their investigation which is not based on facts it's just based on feelings and mean things that we can say about him in the press uh, Speaker Kevin McCarthy raised doubts about whether special counsel David Weiss could be trusted. He was appointed by Donald Trump to do exactly this job and pledged in a statement that House Republicans would continue their investigations into the president's family. Their investigations should have quotation marks around them. They really should. Their investigations are just talking shit and getting uh, and paying witnesses to say the things that they want them to say. The literal, real, actual fact-finding mission is what the House GOP doesn't want. Kevin McCarthy doesn't want facts and logic to be presented. He does not want investigations that find facts. That ruins his whole game of just talking shit.
Kevin McCarthy is a professional shit talker who doesn't want facts to get in the way. This great, super cool uh, tweet from the, the Donald. We've got uh, David Weiss was picked by the two Democrat senators from Delaware under blue slip. He would not have been picked by me. He would not have been picked by me. 2017, president to nominate David Weiss for U.S. Attorney in Delaware. He was literally picked by you, Donald. He was literally picked by you. Anti-reality. You know? Anti-reality. I don't love Joe Biden or the Democrats. Honestly. They're mediocre at best. But these are my choices, right? We live in a first-past-the-post system. 51% of the vote make, means you're the winner of 100%. Not happy about that, but that's the way the system is built. I would like the system to be built differently, but in the system that we have, Democrats are the mediocre, middle-of-the-road, boring people. They promise big things during the uh, primaries. Oh, we're going to get... Uh, uh, UBI, we're going to do this for taxes, we're going to get uh, Medicare for all, we're going to increase these things, we're going to increase these things, we're going to do all this stuff. Then when they do get elected, they do meh, maybe nothing. That's not a choice I'm happy to make, but it's a choice I have to make because who's running against them? Lunatics who do not accept reality. Those are my choices. Mediocre Democrats or Republicans who will make make up anything they want. They will say whatever they want, and it doesn't matter if it's based on facts. It only matters if it's based on the feelings they have or the feelings of the people who are following them. There is a those are those are your choices in America. Mediocre Dems who aren't really going to give you what you want, or Republicans who are going to say whatever they feel absent reality it's not a great system we have but it's the way it is do i love the idea of hunter biden using his last name to make money no it's corrupt it's crony capitalism but it's a capitalist flaw it's a flaw within capitalism not some giant uh crime that Joe Biden has committed. If he's involved, great. Let's have the DOJ investigate. Let's figure it out. Let's find out what actually happened. And if there are any crimes, then we charge him for crimes. That's what the DOJ is supposed to do. Not this forever uh, continuing investigation that McCarthy is doing, where you're not actually finding anything out. You just shit talk all day long. Shit talk, shit talk, shit talk all day long. Nothing else. They don't want anything else. They don't want actual justice. They don't want actual investigation. They don't want facts to get in the way of their shit talking. Which is why they're upset about it. Is he crooked? Yes. But within the capitalist system that we're forced to live under, uh, he's a crony capitalist at worst. Well, at best, he's a crony capitalist. At worst, he is involving Joe Biden in getting that money. But there is no evidence of that right now. The DOJ is going to find that evidence. And if there isn't any, you know what's going to happen? McCarthy's just going to say, oh, well, this proves. If, if, if the DOJ finds evidence that Joe Biden was involved, McCarthy's going to say that proves that, the, that Joe Biden is crooked. If the DOJ doesn't find evidence, and they find zero, they find nothing. Kevin McCarthy then says, oh, that's the proof that he's crooked. When you find evidence, that proves the crime. When you don't find evidence, that proves the crime. Because it proves that Joe Biden is crooked and owns the DOJ and tells them what to do all the time. And then he gets to uh, choose his special counsels. And then they hide all the evidence. McCarthy will make up whatever fantasy he wants to get the outcome he desires. He will make up whatever lies to get the 
answer he wants. If he wants Hunter Biden to be a criminal, he will invent evidence. He will take the evidence and point to it and say, here's the evidence. If there isn't any evidence, he will use that as the evidence that the evidence has been hidden from him. They will just make up whatever they want, whenever they want, to whatever end they want. And it irritates me. <laughs> because they're, half the country votes for them. Half the country loves that. Half the country loves it. They love making up horseshit to make themselves feel better. Can't run a country that way. Oh, hi. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. Uh, if you liked what you saw, hit the like button. Press the subscribe button. Uh, if you want to tell me how right I am, feel free to leave a comment. If you want to tell me how wrong I am, uh, leave a comment too. That's good. Um, this is just kind of a hobby for me, so I appreciate you uh, coming by, giving it a watch, and uh, pressing the YouTube buttons. Thanks.